St. Charles Medical Center Bend's eight pediatric rooms are full right now with children who are struggling to breathe as they fight RSV, respiratory syncytial virus. Children who have a lot of respiratory distress, sometimes they need extra help with breathing, whether that's a device that helps kind of blow some pressure into their lungs to help them keep their lungs inflated, or we have had a few children who've required um, what we call mechanical ventilation, where they need to be on a breathing tube um, and have the ventilator do the work of breathing for them. On Monday, Oregon Governor Kate Brown issued executive orders that give hospitals flexibility to draw from pools of volunteer nurses and doctors in response to the surge in pediatric respiratory virus cases. If we had capacity, um, sometimes we can't take children from the northern campuses, which makes it really hard, and they have to go to Portland, but then Portland's been at capacity capacity as well for um, the two children's hospitals in the state. And so that's made it challenging. Ben Lapine schools report increased numbers of students out with illnesses right now. While they cannot say exactly which illnesses, respiratory concerns are common. RSV is hammering communities across the country. Health officials encourage everyone to help prevent the spread of illness by staying home when they're sick, covering sneezes and coughs, and practicing good hand hygiene. You really don't want to get RSV plus flu together, so recommending vaccination as well. Brooks Navely, Central Oregon Daily News.